Yo guys, what's going on? It's Shawno here, and today I'm going to be doing something a bit different. While the H1Z1 servers are down, I'm just going to address this issue that I've seen pretty important. It's pretty important to me, it's pretty important to everyone out there, and it's really frustrating me. Since the release of H1Z1, everywhere I look, I just see thousands of fucking noobs, like serious fucking noobs screaming, LOL, H1Z1, pay to win, LOL, it's pay to win, LOL, 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 pay to win, pay to win. Well, guess what? The game's not fucking pay to win, you retards. And it's funny because like half of you don't even have the fucking game. Let's be honest. You don't even have the game. You're just like saying online, oh, it's pay to win, right? Even the fucking paper, right? I live in England, right? Which is miles away from like H1Z1 HQ and that. And I, I read the paper and it's like H1Z1 pay to win. What the fuck? I mean, the editor's like 50 years old and he's crying about this game being pay to win. I mean, get a fucking grip and report some actual news. LOL, H1Z1, pay to win. You're just fucking stupid, really, ain't you? You're fucking stupid. If you're still not convinced, right, I'm going to prove it to you right now in this video. And for those who don't really care what I've got to say, here's a hot girl stripping. So let's get into it, right? You go into the H1Z1 store and there's three things you can buy here, right? The first thing is a crate key, which yes, opens up crates, right? But these crates have only got cosmetic items only. And if you think that's pay to win, then you are actually more retarded than anyone I've ever known. And you should probably quit playing games and do something different, like painting fences. Because let's take, for example, Arsenal Football Club, yeah? Do you think if they paid for like a really expensive, fancy cosmetic football kit that they will actually win games? Fuck no! Arsenal are a shit team and always will be a shit team, no matter what they're fucking wearing. And that's a fact. LOL, H1Z1, pay to win. Fuck you, man. Now the next thing in the store is the event ticket. And I've actually seen people online saying, LOL, you have to pay to get into a server. Pay to win. LOL, LOL, pay to win. Granted, these tickets will get you into a special server, yeah? Which is called Battle Royale. But you don't have to pay for these tickets. You get them free when you get the game, and you get them free while you're playing the game, not to mention the prizes involved in Battle Royale. So if you wasn't such a retarded player and played the game well, then you'll never actually lose tickets. You'll gain more tickets and be a ticket hoarder, and you can also win airdrop tickets. All of this from Battle Royale, just being good at the game, and you get rewarded for it. You don't have to pay a fucking penny. Now onto the final and most controversial point is the actual airdrops. Airdrop tickets do cost $5 each, I'll give you that. And yes, an airdrop will drop some kind of gear, but this isn't fucking pay to win. If you call an airdrop, don't think for one second it's going to be easy gear. First thing, the plane. The plane is so fucking loud, you may as well fucking run a server-wide noob dinner bell, mate. You better have a weapon, because half the server right now is coming to your location in seconds. And then there's the actual drop. The drop is so damn slow, all the PvP is going to kick off before the thing is even dropped. And then the zombies come down with the crate. you got to make sure you deal with them before you can loot anything. Which are pretty hard, by the way. So let's say you've done everything, right? You're some kind of god. You've called the drop. You've killed half of the noobs on the server that have come to the drop. You've killed the zombies. And you feel like some kind of boss. There's the loot issue. It's not guaranteed guns. In fact, it's only a 10% chance of even a gun drop. It could be shit, and that's totally useless to you, and you feel like you've wasted five dollars. So don't tell me this fucking game is pay to win, bruv. It's not fucking pay to win. And anyone that says it's pay to win, mate, you should just quit. Just quit playing, just, just don't play games, because you clearly don't have the right, you know, brain cells or something. There's something not quite right up in there, so you can't play games. Alright? Sweet. Sorry about the rant, but had to be said. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and all that good stuff.